Hello, and welcome to another Drive Time Principles with Lenisa. Well, as we always do, let's affirm ourselves. Today is an incredible day. Success, prosperity, and abundance in many different forms have naturally found their way into my life today, and I gratefully enjoy their manifestations throughout my entire day and happily share these blessings of abundance with many others to bring happiness to their day as well. Yes, I am happy, I am healthy, I am wealthy, I am worthy, I am secure, I am beautiful, I am blessed, I am confident, I am courageous, I am excited about today. I am a Proverbs 31 woman. I am a godly woman. Everything I touch prospers. I'm a multi-millionaire. I own several successful businesses. I am a money magnet. I owe no man nothing. I am debt free. I am in a loving, committed relationship with the man of my dreams. And I am loved by him more and more each and every day. I am a world-renowned motivational speaker and author. I am an awesome mother. I am able to supply all of my children's wants and needs. Yes, I am happy and I am full of joy. I am made in his image, which means I am love. I am Lenisa. So let's get into today's principle. And this is going to be a quick one, but it's going to be one that's going to challenge us. And the reason it is challenging is because we have a tendency to do the opposite. For example, I've got a lot of things going on in my life over these couple of months. I've had a crying daughter who's turned one, which meant a huge celebration. Okay, so that costs what? De Niro. I have a sister that is getting what? Married, which means I needed to pay for my children because I helped supply all my children's wants and needs when there is a need and I knew they couldn't physically do it themselves. What did I have to do? I had to step in as mother and help get everybody to the wedding. All right. Three, I have a daughter that's getting married. We won't even talk about that. So we know financially what that looks like. Correct. I have a stepdaughter that I love to death that is also getting married. Should I keep going? And this car around me, having to do some financial changes with this car, which means money. So you can say that Lanisa is consumed with how, when, why, where, how I'm gonna do this. So probably, I'm not gonna say I spend all day on it, but three or four, at least three or four hours a day throughout the day, I'm thinking of how to make these things happen how to make these things financially all work together since they're bump, 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 bump. Well, the principle around is just 60 seconds. See, do you realize you manifest what you think? And that's why we start off our affirmations every morning with I am, I am, I am. But when life gets so hectic and things start just crashing in on you and they seem like they're coming from everywhere, we're all human, what do we do? We start thinking of how, when, where, why is this particular issue gonna either be eliminated or gonna be fixed? Well, instead of taking the time to do that, I want you to take 60 seconds to think of the outcome, the positive outcome that you want to happen. Yeah. 60 seconds. Do you realize those 60 seconds will do more for your life than those four to five hours I was spending throughout the whole day thinking of how, when, where, and why, and how? Yeah, they will. See, there's even been a study made on it. They put two 
um, they divided two children in a um, different group, two boys into different groups. And both were centered around basketball. One group was told to go shoot basketball for 60 seconds every day. The other group was told just to sit and imagine shooting basketball free throws every day and, being, and imagine hitting them, being successfully hitting them, making the shot. Well, do you know when the actual time came later? Do you know who made the most free throw show throws? You got it. The ones that took 60 seconds to imagine that they were successful. Now, I know this may seem simple, and Lenise, I can do it. It's not that simple. Trust me. It's hard for your mind to even sit and concentrate on this right now. You, you've got other things going on in your mind right now. Don't you? Stop. Stop. Just think about it. How many other thoughts did you have? You did. And typically... After 10, 5 to 10 seconds of thinking about anything, we start think bouncing back from someone. I want you to take a concentrated 60 seconds and think about that thing that you want, that you need, or that you just gotta have in your life. Think about it positively as if you already have it. 60 seconds. Get a friend. I challenge you to get a friend. Do this with be your account. Let that be your accountability partner, and, and say, "Have you have you done your sixty se seconds today?" So, instead of using four to five hours to think what, what, when, where, and how, why, take sixty seconds to think of the positive outcome. And you know, guys, I would love to hear how this came out for you. And I'm going to tell you how it came out for me too, because I've got some sixty seconds things that I'm sitting here thinking about as well all right well as you all know um i do this every day and what is it called drive time principles and these are principles that are what training your mind every day with principles that will ultimately what change your life guys love you have an awesome awesome day and as I always say Lenisa is signing out.